Hello and welcome to Ghost Theory. In this episode, we venture into an old house that appeared abandoned from the outside. However, as soon as we stepped inside, an eerie feeling crept over us, making us question whether we were alone or unwelcome guests. With minimal editing, what you're about to see is almost entirely raw footage captured during our investigation. Hello and welcome to another episode of Ghost Theory. Now this is probably going to be quite an intense one. We're in this house, very old fashioned house, middle of the day. Um, lights are all on, looks like you know someone is kind of looking after it, but the doors here behind this curtain are wide open, so it's quite easy access. However, I don't think we've actually got long here. We have been hearing some amazing noises as soon as we got in so much so that we thought that the owner was still up there in bed well you say that we've checked the fridge and there's still food and sauce in there that is in date yeah so we know somebody comes here it might not even be abandoned it might just be mm. <laughs> it might just be someone who can't look after the building i don't know yeah or in the hands changing so we're gonna get straight into this um we're gonna use probably not um as much equipment in this because obviously yeah, some of our equipment's loud so we're going to go off instincts um we don't want to get caught are there any spirits here we know we may be intruding we don't mean any harm we mean you and the property total respect we're here to figure out if there is life after death There was creaking upstairs. Of course there is. There can't be there. You can't even like get in some of the rooms up there. It's so full of stuff. Can you make a sound to let us know you're here? Can we check to make sure there's something no one here first? I've yeah. We haven't actually had a look out there. Go on then. We show some of the stuff as well. Does that go to the same upstairs? Sounds silly, but you know. I, what I mean? haven't actually checked that way, no. See, so look, the fridge is still open. And that sauce in there is for next month. I mean, it's still quite dark in this place. Yeah. It's insane. If there's anybody here that can make a noise, let us know that you're here. Really appreciate it. Love all the history of this sort. I don't know. So one thing I've noticed as well is there seems to be lots of stuff like chainsaws and things. Which isn't good. <laughs> but I mean look. That window's just there's no there isn't a window there. Yeah. There's an incredible amount of stuff in here. Which could be good for like you know, attachments. I don't even want to know what's through that door. Fuck. I need to get away from that window. I was going to say, Joe, seriously, there was a click behind me just then. Hmm. Really loud. I'm wondering if it's actually the fridge, but it was just like a... Yeah. You heard it again then. That was water. Oh, for fuck's sake. Has any of this been used recently? It's incredible. Yeah, that sink has been used. Yeah. People, and there's a beep. We need to go. Or well, not necessarily. Say, so, actually, the road. Um, it's just there, isn't it? So, mm. kids come. Are there any spirits here? Let's go upstairs. You go first, because if you die, I know. 
I just heard a creaking upstairs. We either look or we go, one or the other. We need to look fast and then... I don't know where that goes. I mean, all this stuff is fucking brand new. There's axes and shit. Whoever ends this does lots of wood stuff, like... We're clearing the place out. That's the thing, is it, is it being... renovated? Hmm. I don't think we should stay long. We need to get some. I keep hearing whistling. But it's birds. Oh, that's just fucking crazy. Hello? Is there someone up here? If there is, we don't mean you any harm. We're just explorers and we like history. If you want us to go, we will. This is definitely just being cleared out. Oh, it's not even clear, is it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can we go in one of the rooms, do you think? It'd be good to show what's in here. Sorry about the lack of light, but we don't want to give ourselves away. I think we're going to have to have this as a raw and uncut one. Yeah. Can you make a noise if there are any spirits here? We love your house. It's absolutely stunning. We're not here to ridicule you. We're not here to steal or damage. We're here in total respect. Please make a noise. Hello?
What's that? I keep hearing like knocks and clicks. It is windy. Yeah. Can you throw something? Can you slam a door or use your voice? Was that, that you? That was me, moving on the floorboards. There are two upstairs. <sighs> yeah. There's two sides. The other one is a ladder because the stairs have right. Yeah. We need to go upstairs on the other side now as well, don't we? Hello? There's something keeps dripping or something. The fact the lights are on just purely means the space is definitely being looked after to some degree. Yeah. And that the readers might be want to be here. No. We've got that rule of like we want places to be actually abandoned. Yeah, and again, it could be like locals looking after it, you just never know. I just feel so unwelcome. Yeah. I don't know, it's weird, because I feel like the building wants doesn't mind us, but that sounds weird. Yeah, yeah. But the spit of the, it is haunted or whatever, the building feels welcoming. It feels amazing. Yeah. just doesn't feel like owners would be particularly happy about it. No. <clears throat> Fuck. I mean, this is an absolute dream for just exploring and general sort of... Yeah. You know, all the different things on the walls and all the different things that would tell you about the people's life. It's just even the shape of the building is just so yeah. back in time. The wallpaper and everything. It's honestly, I think, one of my favourite places again. This is a children's room. Yeah, I was going to say, there's loads of kids' stuff everywhere. And that just, it felt that this room is actually off. Mm. It like could you, be where it's wonky. I was going to say, it's wonky, I've just had the front door. No, I didn't. Don't worry. Oh, shit. Are there any children here? I mean, look how abandoned this is. Like, all the decay of the war and everything. This has been empty, or well, not lived in, for a very long time. Very, very, very long time. This room feels... bad. <laughs> Actually. Hello? It's this room that knocking drip sounds coming from. I wonder if that was my zit. No, because I've been hearing that all along. It's got maybe just where it's been raining. We don't want to give ourselves away with putting lights on, because there are houses just over there, and the windows aren't really boarded up, so it's much better for ourselves. We can stay here longer if we're not seen. We're calling out to any spirits. Please come and talk to us. Hopefully by now you can tell we're not bad people. Was that you on the floor then that knocked? It could have been because the floors are very creaky. Yes. Yeah.
Yeah, that was loud. We need to go. They're outside. I can't see anyone. Come on, Edge. I know. Then they're about to walk in. I feel like we just need to go. For some reason. Because of that. I mean, we've been asking for it. We know exactly. there's no one. Well, we don't know there's no one in the other bit. Can you do that knock again? I just heard it again as you moved. It's definitely not you because it's coming from my left. Hello? It sounds like it's a little yappy dog just there. Yeah. We had this constant feeling of feeling like we were not on our own. I don't think that's paranormal. I think that's purely because we were there during the day. We never film during the day. Um, and there was also people walking around outside. So we obviously thought those people could have walked in at any point. They could have been the owners. So it just made us feel like we shouldn't be there. We also found that there was still food in the fridge, still in date, very clean, and the washing up had been done. So we didn't feel like we should be there just out of respect. Yeah, we need to look in the other bit, don't we? Someone's been in there. The lamp. The lamp's off. Fuck off, is it? The lamp's off. surely. So the lamp could have been anything, but it was strange that we were asking for that sort of thing to happen. I do think it could have been just the bulb blowing or it was on a timer, but it is up to you to decide. We haven't got any proof of what happened there at all. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking flies. <laughs> the lamp actually turned itself off while we were downstairs. We didn't notice until we went upstairs and came back down but I will actually upload all the footage of the, the angle so you can see that it was off when we go downstairs, but you can see we didn't turn it off. So everyone should be able to see that in the description. There's no way someone's just been in here and done that. It's impossible. What was that? Is that doof? Just turn on for half an hour, turn off for five, turn on for an hour, turn off for 20. A lot of people do have like random timers. See if it comes back on, hang on. Yes. 
is insane. Yeah. This. I don't think you can get through there. Right. The floor is not safe. It's been sealed. Are there any spirits here? I keep hearing stuff. Hello? That's birds in the roof, but they're dripping. Water, isn't it? Again. It's so confusing, so this was a study then. Yeah. Mm, wow. Hello? Come and talk to us, please. That was loud. Behind me. I think it is just people walking dogs and shit. Yeah. It keeps sounding like people are walking around the building, but it's not. Okay. We need to go into that main living room, I think, and call out and see if that light's come back on. Hmm. I think just stay near the stairs. Yeah. And just try and listen to the whole building generally. Okay. I mean, nothing distinct has happened. No, it sort of did before we started recording. We could hear... Lots of creaking upstairs. Yeah, it sounded like there was someone upstairs, but... It could be anything, really, couldn't it? Is there anyone here? Is there any spirit to anyone who lives used to live in this building? Can you try and talk to us? Are we allowed to be in this building? Do you mind us being in your home? If that's you making those noises, can you make them louder?
There are so many weird noises, but I don't know what it is. I've got this weird, overwhelming mm. sensation thing to fuck off. Me too. Hello? Some of them stand out from dripping. If you don't want us here, can you please make a, a loud noise for us? As distinctive as you can make it. Is like walking or something? Yeah. Please make a loud noise if you want us to leave. As loud as you can. It's not just that they could come back any minute that's getting me. This place has a you don't belong here feel. Mm. Hello? If that's a spirit, please make yourself known. Is that water though? Is it Some just water? of it is. Is all of it? I don't know. Some of it's so loud. Some of it sounds like it's over there by the books. Is there anything you wish to tell us? There's loads of electric stuff. I think we've been here 45 minutes. Yeah. It's not very long. We'll just keep everything we recorded. Cause it's an amazing place. There might be something that we haven't heard and it's picked up on the cameras. Yeah. We need to leave out of respect for the people who own this mm. because it isn't truly abandoned and it's, we're not comfortable. No. But it's still a fascinating place full of history. It's still good. And I think we have actually captured some interesting stuff considering how small of a time we've been here. Yeah.